Hey guys, welcome back to some more MechWarrior Online. Uh, I had a lot of positive feedback actually from the last MechWarrior Online uh, LP I did. So I figure uh, anytime I get a new interesting build, I'll, um, or like setup going or playstyle going, I'll show you guys and I'll also talk about MechWarrior Online and all that kind of stuff. So today we are going to be playing with my first light mech uh, that I have fully upgraded. He is a Raven 3L, uh, fully equipped with an ECM, which I'll talk about later. He's also got a rather nice, uh, I probably actually shouldn't be moving up this far because uh, this game mode is actually a resource capping one which I will be talking about a little bit later, but I will. I think I'll, I think I'll try and take the middle point uh, theta over there. So, so uh, yeah, so this is my first uh, uh, light mech loadout and uh, I'll talk a little bit more about the playstyle and all that kind of fun stuff, but um, for the time being, uh, I'm just going to be trying to cap this point. But uh, first of all, uh, if you want to get into MechWarrior Online, now, has n now is the best time to actually do it because they've recently done some economy changes where you are able to buy your first mech really quickly. Uh, it's actually quite nice. Uh, you can you get like a cadet bonus, which is like a, a bit of a money bonus when you begin. So, um, so yeah, try and get into it now. You don't get as much money for winning matches. It's more about now. Uh, in this game mode, you get more money for having more resources. So me capping this point pretty early... Uh, really works well into our favor. Uh, so I have, uh, I got a stalker here who's gonna help me out. So part of my role as a light mech is to go scout them out. Um, target acquired. So we do have some mechs over here. So I am I am equipped with uh, uh, streak SRMs, uh, two of them. One of them, one of the streak SRMs, however, is in my narc slot, which means it only fires acquired. one missile at a time, which is quite unfortunate. Um, part of my job here, though to piss people the fuck right off. So uh, I'm just going to just circle strafe him and run away. So he just tried to ERPPC me, but it, I am extremely hard to hit. And so I'm just going to keep, uh, I'm going to like stop this cap so he has to go and deal with me for a bit. And I'm going to lock onto this guy. The great thing though is people cannot get, uh, the ECM does a couple things. Uh, it prevents people from getting a lock on me. Uh, within, uh, they have to be within 200 meters of another enemy for the, for them to get a proper lock on me. And I so want to get this guy. Um, it also, people near me cannot be locked on. He can't lock on to other people. Oh, this guy's using the Mike Lat build. No, that's not really my build. Unfortunately, PPCs do like half damage or something for, for him. Uh oh, I want to get closer to him because he won't do as much damage. And he's gone. All right. We are actually doing really well. ECM does a couple of things, yeah. So it cloaks me, so I'm a, I'm a fantastic scouting mech. I am a direct counter to streak builds. Like this one, watch this. I go right in front of him, that's it. He, he he's, uh, he's literally got a build that I counter, because PPCs I can get really close to. He doesn't do a lot of damage. I should probably not stand behind him because my own teammates are now shooting me. Um, so it cloaks, it cloaks my fellow allies. Oh, wow. That poor soul. <laughs> uh, it cloaks my eyes so they can't be detected as easily. Uh, LRMs can't really lock on as easily. It's it's quite nice. So this guy has uh, two AC5s, uh, but I think I'm not going to fuck with him, but I'm going to try and fuck with this guy. Holy shit. So one of the great things about me is I can just stand right behind him and uh, take out his back, back armor. It's always great when you're a uh, light mech and you're able to just circle strafe guys and just like take out their back armor. It's a lot of fun. Uh oh, okay, I'm gonna get out of here. One of the things though, as a light mech, is you do not want to lose your uh, leg armor. And I do this mistake so much, I, 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 I harm myself and I cause so many problems for me. So this Jenner, actually, I'm going to be basically, I'm gonna go counter him because the streak SRMs, he will not be able to lock on. And they're completely useless if he doesn't uh, lock, lock on to me, so. I can use my streak SRMs, he can't use his own. So, I, apparently he's depressed now. Okay, I just I guess I'll just hit you in the back armor. I don't know, does he realize if he's being hit yet? I guess I'll just stand right here, alright. Now I think, I think as a, as a light mech, oh, I killed someone. I think as a light mech, speed is very important, so I actually strapped on the, like the, the, the fastest engine I could on this thing and I go 140 kph which I think is the cap for this game um, so you cannot 
I don't think you can go any faster than 140. Even if it says you do, I don't think it matters. This may have changed, though, recently. Um, so I, I honestly think this is one of the best light dueling mechs um, out there. And the ECM is apparently working as intended. It's really quite good. Uh, as I said, counters streak SRMs. Counters LRMs, you just piss off like the LRM guys by uh, LRM missile boats, basically, just by going in front of them and, and just, be, just, just being in proximity. Just like they can't do a thing. Um, and so we're, I guess we're now going to, uh, I guess we're done. I guess I've, we've officially, what the hell? The, the game doesn't end? <laughs> uh, we, we've killed everybody. It, it hasn't, uh, it hasn't gone anywhere though. That's kind of weird. Oh well. Um, but I really like the light mech playstyle. Uh, it's not as combat oriented per se. You do have to pick your fights. Uh, where is Sigma? I, I'm sorry, I thought that was Sigma. Uh, it's apparently back there. But you are you are the, the best class for for getting into engagement, scouting out, and exploiting weaknesses. And I've been learning that that strategy a whole lot of of learning to exploit weaknesses. And someone's component got destroyed. Okay. Um, because you know if you see someone has like a bad leg or something, then you take it out. If you see somebody has like a weak back torso or something, or they're distracted, you exploit that weakness. That's that's your entire job um, as a light class. And so this game mode in particular uh, is about resources and it will end at 750. Uh, you can see our, our scores in the yellow uh, on the upper left. And we have all the caps here, but for some reason, like it's just like, it's, it's mech warrior wait for 750 resources um, online. It's kind of weird. This guy's got the flamethrower. He's such a baller. Um, but yeah, this is an interesting game mode. It, it, it adds a bit of variety uh, to, to a game that honestly I, I think needed it. Because, uh, it, it, you know, you can only do so much with that assault game mode. And, and also the, the, the money changes as well is actually quite nice. Because you don't, by capping, you don't necessarily get any money bonuses. You get experience bonuses, but not really so much on the, um, uh, on the money. So... So it's it's all about assists and kills and and being a team player. You know, if you go and you die first, then you're not going to do much. If you're disconnected or AF, AFK or something, you're not gonna you're not gonna get much out of it. I feel like I feel like just capping epsilon because I'm a I, I got serious OCD issues. Yeah, epsilon is mine. Well, looks like we win. Um, so on this mech, I also have an ACM, uh, sorry, uh, blah, I, I already said ECM, uh, AMS, which is, uh, it will shoot down incoming missiles, so it helps me counter other streak guys, uh, three medium lasers, as you saw, and two streaks, so, um, as I said, streaks only will, will fire if I, uh, if I have a lock, so it's a guaranteed hit, but I have to hit them, uh, so, well, I have to, I have to achieve a lock, so if someone else has an ECM, it counters my streak thing, but I can put it into counter mode, like that, which you can't really see it, but uh, it does. It, it prevents their ECM from counter, uh, from from preventing uh, me from getting a lock. So, all right, well, let's uh, hop into another game here. Uh, did pretty well. Wow, uh, these these two XP guys are are clan guys, I guess, and I got a fair bit of money from that. So let's go into another match. Okay, we're back for another conquest uh, game on this same map, actually, and it's uh, I'm on the other side, so I guess we get to see it from the other angle. Um, so continuing on my whole thing with lights, um, so my whole thing with the light mechs is though, is that they're very difficult to get into because they have a high buy-in basically. Uh, it costs a lot to have a good light mech, it costs a lot of uh, C bills. So you're probably, your first mech is probably better off being an assault mech. Uh, I'm just kind of showcasing the playstyle and how I play it. And it's also, you get used to, get used to dying a lot because it's, it's actually a fairly difficult, uh, it's fairly difficult to achieve a good, um, uh, to, to play very well. It's You get used to getting, like, uh, your first couple matches as a light, you're probably going to get sniped by someone with a Gauss. And the, and the default Raven actually blows a ass. You go, like, 80 kilometers per hour, where, like, some mediums will even outrun you. Uh, you're all about the need for speed as a light. And you have to, you have to take that into account. Uh, but, but yeah, so, um... 
Some things about this mech is that I have the Furofurbrius armor on it. I don't know if I pronounced that right. I apologize if I did did not. Um, target acquired. We have some targets incoming, and there's a Raven on the on there. I target acquired. All right, let's let's go let's go back cap them. So um, I have I have the armor which basically it takes up 14 criticals. Uh, but the, you get to have more armor for uh, for your ton, which is which is good because you don't actually use a lot of criticals on your on light max Because all I have is like as you noticed, a bunch of a bunch of medium lasers and two streak SRMs, um, and just a little bit of ammo for all of them. Then that's it. I also have the endo steel armor on this, and I also have an XL engine. So endo steel basically makes it so. Uh, the way internal structures work in this game is that uh, normally it will take 10% of your entire tonnage. So 3.5 tons on this 35 ton mech uh, will be automatically reserved and thrown away onto the new target uh, onto the internal structure. Now, uh, going to endosteel makes it 5%, but it takes up 14 criticals once again. So I reserved a lot of criticals away acquired. for things like that, and it's like, uh, you know... It's it's a, it's a throwaway, and this dragon apparently is helping me. Okay, I probably should go help my team after I d I'm done capping this. I just like to have one cap over them, and that that's uh, that means we don't spend the entire match losing just because uh, we're not doing too well. All right, uh, and the other uh, the last thing I have is also an XL engine. And the way XL engines work in this is they take up more criticals uh, in the in the torso slots, uh, and they way less but they're very 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 expensive that was the most expensive thing on this mech and it was a total pain in the ass to get i, ha I currently have two XL engines uh, one of which i share between two of my mechs uh which is which is something you can do uh, you just buy one XL engine and you can repurpose it does i mean you're only playing with one mech at a time all right let me go get that guy target acquired all right Oh. Got him. There you go. That's what I mean about New taking taking acquired. taking people's uh, weaknesses into uh, into account. Uh, and my game is slightly lagging. I, I I'm feeling being shot from from somewhere, so I'm gonna get the fuck out of here. Oh wow. Okay, I did not see those guys. Okay, I'm getting out of here. That was bad. Oh man. Uh, yeah, my black my back armor's gone. My armor 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 is gone. I'm s I'm sorry if uh, someone saw that coming. Oh shoot, we are screwed. Our entire team died. Okay, I probably should have stuck with them. All right. Uh, I don't think there's gonna be much I can do. Uh, so I'm probably gonna just uh, go for new target acquired. The awesome light play style of trying to assist my team here. Let's target see if anyone has a acquired. weakness I can exploit. All right, let's get this guy. New target acquired. Gonna just keep circle strafing him. So XL engines take up a, a, a side torso slot. Um, and so that means if my side torsos go critical, which they very well might, uh, then I will be screwed. Uh, and and that that means you you are much more fragile. But you know, as a as a as a raven, that's that's pretty important to know. You know, it's kind of just you you want to be kind of a fragile mech. So. You kind of just take it into account. I also have no heat sinks on this mech. That's also important to note. Uh, no heat sinks whatsoever. Oh man, I am the last person alive on my my team here. <laughs> he's he's asking me to stop running. We. I'm just gonna be in the trees here. Um, okay, well, uh, yeah, so I'm a very fragile mech, but, you know, uh, the way I work is I just want to be in and out really quick. You see, the need for speed really works well. It's, uh, 
It's actually quite nice. I, I love being a speedy little mech. And I think someone was trying to shoot me. Acquired. Oh, there's someone. Warning, incoming missile. Uh, and I'm about to die. Oh, I'm dead. You know, I, I think this I think this game really just wants me to play this map this entire time. Because this is like the third time I've been on it. At any rate, I'll talk about some more playstyles with the Raven uh, or Light Max in general. Um, commandos are really freaking small. They're even smaller than this. I, I like, they're like half the size of Ravens. The Ravens are even pretty small. But uh, you've probably noticed if you have played this game... Um, I can make very fast and quick movements, which is a fantastic thing about this mech. It's just like, you, you can do, like, just like, the arms pretty much keep up with my torso. So it doesn't even matter uh, what I what I do. Uh, which, I, which I really like about uh, the light mechs. It's just, there are some situations where you just can't win, and sometimes you just, you kind of feel powerless to engage you really have to it's not a soloing mech essentially like there's i i would i could say that you know some mechs are good for fuck he took out my leg am i gonna be safe here uh acquired. New target i gotta acquired. get out of here yeah um i'm a uh, light mech without his leg is a dead mech uh, uh with the dead legs i hate it because it's just you're just so dead. So one of the first things I did with actually this light mech is I maxed out the armor uh, with the exception of one of my arms. So just so I didn't have a weird percentage. Oh, you son of a Jenner. New target acquired. And oh, oh no, I thought I was being hit. I wasn't. New target acquired. Or I am being hit. Okay, well, I'm just going to run away. Because that's the one thing I'm good at, is I'm good at running away and being a little whore. Uh, Light Max. Pretty cool playstyle. Oh, oh, dude, I killed him. Look at that. <laughs> so that's just kind of what you do. You swoop and take the Target kills. That's, that's the best thing you can do as, uh, as a Light Mech. Um, so at this point, I'm being Target much more conservative acquired. as I was before because I took some leg damage I really didn't want to. New target uh -oh. acquired. Uh, how much, uh, the catapult with two LRM-20s. Let's go piss them off. Now, right now, I am preventing him from using, using his missiles, just because I'm within 180 meters. Oh. And now I'm gonna just sit, sit behind him. And now he's, like, confused. Where, where did Mike go? Oh, no, I'm, I'm just hungry, hungry in the corner here. Oh, whoops. I'm sorry, man. I didn't mean to shoot you. Okay. Still getting shot up, and I really don't want to. He's kind of bad. Also, I have no heat sinks. I don't know if I mentioned this. My my engine comes with 10 heat sinks. I figured it was completely pointless, because I could just manage my heat. I'd rather have a couple more weapons on me. Oh. He's hugging the corner. I can't do a thing. My one weakness is corners here. And he's making it hard for me to lock on to him. I'm gonna see if I can go exploit his back armor. Oh no, he's gone. All right. New target. I'll take care of him. So let's go uh, cycle through some targets and see. Oh, I, I like the sound of this guy. Uh, does, I don't think he has any center armor anymore. So we kind of go. We we, we dive into this fight. So always keep your speed up. I just slowed down there. I don't really know why. Don't ask me. It was a dumb idea. Wow, this guy has a lot of uh, SRMs and stuff. But I love to circle strafe it because you're so difficult to hit. And you know what? Usually you fall underneath people's radars. Uh, I'm going to hit this guy because I hate him. And I've, I'm really bad at aiming, I'm sorry. He's trying to keep his center torso intact, however, I am taking also out his other torso. And he's totally dead now. Alright, let's take out this guy. My heat's kind of going up as well. See, some people kind of get annoyed by you, but most of the time they're missing most of their shots, so... 
we don't really care. We're, we just, we're just here to kind of manage our heat. I'm gonna try and do some more back shots on this guy. Someone is annoyed by me, so I think I'm gonna flee a little bit and just uh, get some heat off Target me. Acquired. No pun intended. But you know, it's it's kind of bad though, because things like like ERP, like PPCs and gosses, could totally fuck you in just one hit. It's so bad. Uh, you got you really have to be worried. Oh man, that's an atlas. I am almost inclined to go take another cap. I'm gonna take Sigma. Well, well, I we you know my guys are fighting there, and the last time I didn't fight with Target them, then acquired. we didn't win. So. So let's let's as long as they're fighting, I'll fight because I feel like they're they're getting distracted. Oh, it's an atlas. Oh crap! <laughs> no, I'm getting out of here. I'm trying to I'm trying to be all as evasion evading as possible. Yeah, no, this is not a place I want to be. Um, I have one guy there with me, but he's not really fighting. Is he? Is he there? New target acquired. I'm gonna try and take some pot shots at the stalker at his back armor, I, I hope. Okay, that's we almost got this. I know it's like critical damage blinking at blinking at me. New target acquired. Hopefully he'll get distracted by me, because Atlas is taking a long time to turn around. And I'll just keep fleeing. They have a lot of caps. Uh, this is not going to be good. We got to take one. But it's just me and that guy, so we can't take one. If we win this fight, then we'll win. But uh, unfortunately, I don't think that's actually going to be the case. Target acquired. I, I, I'm very indecisive. Okay. I'm just going to keep hitting him in his back. I almost have his back armor. He's almost dead. Come on, come on. I can I got this, I got this. Yeah. This Atlas doesn't like me, but I can probably take him out right now. Yeah. Mike wins. Fortunately, my I'm about to lose my leg and if this Jenner is smart at all, he will take out my leg and then I will then you'll be, be able to see what happens to a mech when they lose their, their their leg which is uh you become a very crippled uh crippled mech damn it get out of here Jenner I don't like your attitude I gotta get out of here well, you know, uh, I don't think we're going to win this battle, but, you know, I can at least take a couple of them down with me, I figure. But look how annoying you can be with just, like, a lot of armor. Oh, boy. Uh, I just got PPC'd, and I'm lagging all over the place. Come on. Get the lock. Get the lock. Come on. They, they still haven't gotten me. That's uh, surprising, to say the least. I'm going to keep hitting him, because uh, I almost win. I'll, I can at least get one mech. Oh, damn. Dude, I got his leg too. He was so mine. <laughs> 